Basketball state tournaments get started tomorrow. Whitehall boys basketball will be there for the first time since 2015. That's more than enough to get any coach excited, but for Josh Hayes, this means something even more. I'm a happy coach, but I'm an even happier father. Josh Hayes is in his fourth year with the Bulldogs, but he's been with star guard Jay Sean Hayes even longer. Man, I was just holding this joke and carrying him around. You know, it seems like five years ago. Now he's taller than me. After Whitehall clinched a spot in their first state tournament in almost a decade, the Hayes duo were able to take it all in. Uh, it means the world. You know, me and my dad have had our ups and downs because of this game. So now to thrive and get to the get to the postseason, it's just amazing to do it with him. Somebody sent me what he uh, tweeted out. And uh, man, it, it made me emotional being able to do this with my son. Um, you know, it's I can't even explain words can't explain it. Of course, it isn't always easy when dad is a former player himself. I wanted it more than them. Um, I wanted it for them. I was one of those crazy dads that's at the game embarrassing his kids, embarrassing, his, embarrassing himself. Um, thank God for a, uh, a close circle and my friends actually checking me on my behavior. The game, it almost put us away from each other, but it got us right back intact just because of our, of our love for the game. So it's just, it's, it's a great journey and I'm looking forward to what's next. And dad hasn't been the only constant for Jay on the court. The goggles have been there as well. I mean, it's, it's definitely something, but I don't really like people feeling sorry for me. We've been keeping that under wraps for eight years. It was only in the last year that the Hayes felt comfortable sharing that Jay has glaucoma and is legally blind in one eye. I've never known what it's been like to see out of both eyes, so I just thought my condition was normal. And then, you know, I started going to a doctor as I got older, told me, oh, I got glaucoma. I never really thought much of it. It's just, I just have to deal with it. That's just who I am. But now, Jay hopes he can inspire. I've heard that more people are starting to feel comfortable wearing goggles uh, because I wear them sometimes. And so I just want to motivate people with that story as much as I can. He's tougher than what I ever thought. Just what's next? Like you, you can't dwell on the good or the bad that just happened. Just move on to the next. As excited as he is for his son's future, dad is happy to linger in these moments a little longer as coach and player and father and son. Man, you know, you could take me tomorrow and I, I couldn't get any happier because I mean, it's just, it's the best feeling that you can have as a former player and as a dad and as a coach. I mean, it's the best feeling I've ever had in my life.